All right, everyone, this is mainly just going to be an FYI video. The new 1.9.2 beta version of Scratch Live is now out and available to download for you to try out. 1.9.2 is mainly just going to be a maintenance release and bug fix update. It addresses a lot of issues in the previous versions and fixes a lot of uh, bugs and issues that were withstanding. Uh, there are a few improvements, though, uh, mainly to the SP6 sample player. As we all know, the SP6 had six sample slots that you can use to load and uh, play your DJ drops, your sound effects, sweepers, jingles, all that good stuff. Uh, well, now there are 24 sample slots now in the SP6. There are uh, four banks now, multiple banks, uh, labeled down here, A, B, C, and D. Uh, so we have 24 slots now in the SP6 that you can use to load and play all your uh, DJ drops, sound effects, all that good stuff. Additionally, you can select uh, for each individual slot the output, uh, the LMA, the auxiliary output, if you have an SL3 or the R mode. Uh, by default, it will be select on master, and this will be grayed out, and then it will just follow the uh, what you have selected over here for the master output. Uh, but if you uh, click the master again to unhighlight it, then uh, you'll be able to select individually which output you want that particular uh, SP6 sample slot to play out of. And you can also mute the uh, sample slots now individually. Uh, but mainly, yep, and that's basically all there is improvement in 1.9.2. There's other few minor feature additions like support for the new Denon uh, Scratch Live uh, MIDI controller. Uh, 96 kilohertz file playback has also uh, been added. Uh, so if you play 96 kilohertz WAV files, uh, those are now supported. Uh, but other than that, that's about it for 1.9.2. It's not a very uh, feature-heavy laden release. It's just mainly a lot of bug fixes and under the hood uh, fix uh, fixing issues and stuff like that. So uh, check it out. Go download the 1.9.2 version. Remember, it's still a beta version. It's not final, so don't use that gigs. Back up all your data, blah, blah, etc., etc. Uh, to download 1.9.2, go to the Scratch Live forums and follow the links there.